Good morning, everybody. It is the first day of school for tens of thousands of kids, and we've invited the experts at the Crisis Center of Tampa Bay to talk about the issue of bullying in school. Whether you are the child being bullied or the one doing the bullying, this is a tough topic that's swept under the rug, so to speak, most of the time until it's too late. The Crisis Center is in the business of tackling these tough issues, creating the CARE anti-bullying program, which includes one-on-one -on -one mentoring, training for school staff, and workshops for parents. Uh, here with more in our studios, we've invited the CEO of the Crisis Center of Tampa Bay, Clara Reynolds, Thank and you. also Angelina Rivera, who is a child and family safety advocate. Thanks for coming in. You know, a lot of people Thank would rather so not talk about this, and they just say, this would never happen to my child. Right. Um, you know, what are the di what is the difference between your child being normal nervous mm -hmm. about school or maybe showing signs of perhaps being bullied or being the bully. Absolutely. And so, obviously, first day of school, everybody's very nervous. And so that initial anxiety certainly is understandable. So if you've got a little person, it's their first time in school, or maybe they struggled in the past, maybe the first couple of days, you might see a little, a little hesitancy. But if you're starting to see it, two, three, four mm -hmm. weeks later, mm -hmm. you might have a problem that you need to have addressed, either with the school or with a trusted professional. We talked about the, the large number of calls that the Crisis Center got from people under the age of 18. Mm -hmm. Share that with our viewers. Yes, yeah, so over 2,800 um, children under the age of 18 called the Crisis Center wow. last year, mm -hmm. um, and there was a, a percentage of them that called us looking for assistance regarding bullying. And so those are things that we want to get out to the community that certainly anyone can call us at any age. So whether you're 10, you're 14, you're 25, mm -hmm. certainly you can call the Crisis Center, call 211 for assistance. But it was very surprising to see the number of young people That's that surprising. were looking looking for help. Close to 3,000 last Absolutely. year, under 18. Angelina, what's the youngest that you've, oh, gosh. you've had experience with the kids? Well, my program covers kindergarten to third grade. Mm -hmm. So I work with children from the age of four to five, all the way up to third grade. Mm -hmm. I've had parents disclose to me that even their children in universal pre-k or even in daycare have experienced a lot of these concerns as well mm -hmm. and have been bullied what do, what is your best advice to the parent listen to your kiddo oftentimes our kids are so embarrassed to even disclose information right. mm -hmm. um, oftentimes they just want to protect the parent you know what just listen and be there ask them about the highlight of their day yeah ask Start them the about what challenged you today were you upset wow. The range of emotions throughout the day, the day can just change. Well, thank you for coming in. It's a conversation we're going to continue on yes. Facebook. Thank if you, you would like to connect with the folks at the Crisis Center of Tampa Bay, please visit them online at crisiscenter.com. Thanks for watching, everybody.